the Lily Agnes Stakes is next. This is a listed race for the two year olds and it's over five furlongs. You blink and you miss it, John. You're not going to want to be drawn particularly wide. And quite a few of these will be. This is a decent sized field. Ambush at the top for Joshua Sutherland. Indian Rupee, Darren Thompson. Zhech for Jim Harrison. Vespertilio Ab Inferno for Padre Hogan. White Star for Derek Hinton. Black Pearl, Rod McGill. Grace Slick, David Robertson. Green Views, Darren Thompson. Perfect Echo, Paul Fisk. Princess Ezen for. Patrick Hogan and smooth talking for Leon van Rensburg. 11 of them in, so it's not too bad. And away they go. Those wide, they're going to have to try and get themselves across if they can. Pulling for its head over on the far side was Indian Rupee, and that one is going to take it up, I think, in the end. And it's Indian Rupee from on its inside, smooth talking on its outside, perfect echo. Those three have shot clear of the nose banded ambush then Vespertillo, Ab Inferno and White Star is after that one that's the grey in the field then Black Pearl, Grey Slick and looking towards the back Zhecht is being taken off its feet but it's Smooth Talking who's gone into the lead then past the two furlong pole and into the straight and it's Smooth Talking who's in the lead but now being hard pressed by Indian Rupee and Indian Rupee's hit the front Indian Rupee goes on from Smooth Talking in second then Perfect Echo Green Views versus Patino Ab Inferno but now the leader starting to tie up inside the final furly stable mate green views is absolutely flying and green views is going to get up to take it green views is going to win the lily agnes from the fast finishing amble second in the really third print zen was closest at the finish in fourth and one of them tailed off badly but it's green views that takes it for darren thompson with ambush second for joshua southern indian rupee for Darren Thompson again was third, perfect echo for Paul Fisk was fourth, and Prince Zezen for Padraig Hogan was also finished fifth. Now Black Pearl for Rod McClure was the one that Tower Rock sustained an injury. That one that's why it didn't finish so well because it was it was a winner last week, wasn't it? So you expected that one to run better than that, but it was injured, so hopefully it'll be okay for next week.